It's been a slow season of migration for birds through the Vaso Lake Bird Observatory in the South Okanagan, with a significant drop in species coming through the area. We had a few days where it was a little bit busy, but the numbers really didn't pick up as they had in the past, or as we would typically expect them to be. So it's been very slow uh, all season, and we also found that it was quite late. A lot of the birds were coming arriving maybe a week or so later than uh, we would typically see them. I think the reason that things were kind of low uh, early on in the season is because we had that late spring, uh, very wet spring, a lot of birds probably couldn't have as many young as they would or maybe they were starting nesting a little bit later than usual. Teams use a tracking process with the birds, outfitting them with a harmless lightweight numbered aluminum band around one of their legs. From there they check things like age, weight, sex and species to then compare with previous year's data. Bird numbers by nature are very cyclical it's very up and down like we catch mostly young birds so it has a lot to do with how productive their breeding seasons were of course it is concerning we always would like to see more birds than less bird population numbers are continuing to decline uh, birds have many threats uh, that they face in their life their lives so one of the big ones of course is habitat loss um, that's kind of the biggest threat for a lot of wildlife we did that, that we just don't have the amount of habitat that we used to have People can help out locally by keeping their cats inside, putting out specialized bird tape on glass windows, keeping bird feeders clean, and creating habitat for birds. One of the biggest things that people can do, of course, um, is learn more about birds, educate themselves. They can visit places like this to learn more about birds. Um, there's lots of resources available. The Vassal Lake Bird Observatory will be hosting their open house on October 2nd from 9 a.m. till noon. For Castnet News in the South Okanagan, I'm Casey Richardson.